guys, what is going on? It's Constantine, aka Smart Kai Commentaries, and uh, as you guys can see by the intro and everything, this is a game of Pac-Man, and it's uh, actually it's not a normal game of Pac-Man. It's actually um, Pac-Man DX Championship Edition, and it's a really, really fun twist on the game of uh, Pac-Man, where you pass by ghosts, and as you see here, if you eat a fruit on one half of the map, you uh, the other half of the map appears with ghosts and stuff, and you pass by them, and they join a chain behind you, and you have to try to form like super point combos and all that stuff, so it's actually really fun. I recommend you guys download it. I, I just downloaded the demo. Oh, shit. <laughs> that was my guitar, uh, which leads me into the next point. Um, yeah, I only downloaded the demo, so, okay. I wrote you guys a song, and uh, here it goes. Here it goes. I'm just kidding, guys. I can't play the guitar. <laughs> so, um, yeah, uh, Anyway, this is my Tuesday commentary that's not on the gameplay. Um, uh, as you guys can see, my name is Smart Cod Commentaries, but the Cod Commentaries will be smart. So I just thought about that. So every Saturday will be the Smart Call of Duty Commentaries where I go over theories and stuff like that. And I think uh, this Saturday I'm going to talk about um, the theories for the world's creation and the Big Bang Theory. And also, if I have enough time in my gameplay, I'm also going to talk about like some uh, co countries and islands and they're go that are going underwater and how they're going underwater because that was a highly requested one on my channel. So, um, yeah, let's get into today's uh, crazy story. Um, pretty much, <laughs> uh, I was on the national team for sailing Optimist and uh, an Optimist sailboat, and I'll put that on uh, the screen, a picture of it. And um, it was really competitive. There were like 500 kids at each regatta, and um, I was pretty good at it. And um, so I qualified for the team, the United States team, to go to Belgium, and uh, there are also events all over the United States. I just aged out, actually, of that sailing class, because I turned uh, 16, so I aged out, but um, I sailed in Florida, New Orleans, Texas, Virginia, Georgia, uh, everywhere, Massachusetts, Cape Cod, uh, New England, uh, Mexico, Belgium, and I'm going to tell you about the story when I went to Belgium in sailing, so... <laughs> So I went to Belgium with my dad, and we uh, we landed in Brussels, and we go to Newport, which is the side uh, by the ocean on the North Sea, and uh, we check into this hotel, and we are on the floor that is directly, we're on the first floor, and um, so we just take the stairs up, and uh, as soon as we got onto the balcony, the street would be like literally 10 feet below us, and um, so the sun would go down really late in Belgium, like at 12 a.m., the sun would still be up, and uh, in the summertime, so uh where me and my dad, we go out to eat the waffles and the chocolate for, for dessert. And uh, every day we'd, we would go out and get the, the Belgian waffles, which freaking orgasmic. It was just delicious. So um, we go out and um, we come back and we're, we're dead tired. It's like 1 o'clock in the morning. And, and I was doing well in the races. I was, I, was, I was doing pretty well, actually. I was highly... I was doing... Hmm, I, was like, I was like 20th. This was like the first day. I was, I was 20th. I had like 300 in the first day, which is pretty good. Uh, for an international regatta, and these kids from France were beating me, were beating, were winning the regatta actually at the time. So uh, we go to bed really late because we're shot, and um, I wake up six o'clock in the morning, and there are these ridiculously loud horns going off, and like crowds of people cheering, and me and my dad are just like, "What the hell is that?" Like we're so confused. I open up the blinds and go out on the balcony, and there's a huge crowd of people crowding the streets and I look on the streets and there are these tractor trailers just running down the street like a parade of tractor trailers and what even what made it even more confusing was on the tractor trailers getting towed by the tractor trailers were these hot girls in bikinis it was a Belgian swimsuit model like parade and they were like people would like vote for like whoever the hottest model it was like I don't know what what it was but like these girls were getting towed on tractors in bikinis and six o'clock in the morning, it was it was dark out, and I was so confused. Like, <laughs> uh, oh my god, it was the biggest mind fuck ever. Like, me and my dad had no idea what was going on. <laughs> it was the weirdest thing ever. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the story. Uh, leave ideas for games for next week. I'm not gonna play Skyrim, guys. I'm sorry. I just don't find that game appealing. I've tried it, and uh, if you saw the video up to this point, leave a comment saying Pac-Man. Till Saturday, guys. Peace.